Have you ever been trying to park but couldn't see your surroundings? Did someone have to get out of the car and yell instructions while you try to park? It can be hard to know what's going on around you if you can't see it. This becomes a bigger problem for people operating heavy machinery, like a crane for instance. Construction workers use a series of signals to tell the crane operator what he should do, but wouldn't it be a lot better if the crane operator could be down there with them while controlling the crane? Hi, I'm Carter Ray, and I built this crane and developed a way to control it with just my hand movements. Here, let me demonstrate. The left hand controls the base of the crane. Moving your hand down makes the crane go forward. Moving your hand up brings it back. The right hand controls the top of the crane. Tilting your hand left moves the top of the crane left. And tilting your hand right brings it back right. Moving your hands up and down control the arm. I had originally planned to use a muscle sensor to sense when the user wanted to switch between cable and arm control mode, but it proved to be unreliable when moving your arms around. Instead of a muscle sensor, I've implemented a button on the glove that I can press to change modes. This overrides the default, moving the arm up and down. A simple press of the button for my thumb changes the modes. My project utilizes three different disciplines in engineering, mechanical, electrical, and cyber. Mechanical engineering was used to build a pulley system to lift the arm. Electrical engineering was used to wire all the components up, and cyber engineering was used to write the program. The gloves I'm wearing have accelerometers attached to them to read my hand rotations. They are still lightweight and functional so that the user can stop to use his hands, then get right back to operating the crane. <laughs>